everybody, with Dean of Handicapping, Thoroughbred Racing from nearby Parks Racing, Ben Salem, Pennsylvania, on Sunday, October the 30th. This is my day at the track.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 7 this afternoon, folks, 3.37 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile test on the dirt track. Phillies and Mares, 3 years old, and up racing for a claiming prize of some $25,000. Contenders number two, Krista Knight, number nine, Carolina Dreams, number seven, Octavia Hill, and number five, Hale to rock and roll. Number two, Krista Knight qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, drops in class by four units, is the overall speed leader in this claiming field, racing at the mile distance on the dirt, and has produced power runs in each of her last five outings, hitting the board in three. Number nine, Carolina Dreams, the overall pace profile leader, has hit the board in both of her last two starts, including a power run win in her second race back. Jockey Anthony Salgado and trainer Marcus Zuleta sent her to the post. They've hit the board with 59% of more than 100 entries saddled as a team to date, with their exceptional 31% win rate, producing a positive 28% return on investment in the process. Race 7 summary number 2, Chris Knight tops my contenders list this afternoon here at Parks, which also includes number 9, Carolina Dreams, number 7, Octavia Hill, and number 5, Hale to rock and roll, 2975, 2975 in the 7 from Parks Racing. Bonus long shots, go to Woodbine in Canada, race 6, the 8 to 1 shot, number 8, stay determined. Qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, takes a class drop of 2 units, Sit the board in power run fashion in three of his last five, including a power run win in his fifth race back. Mountaineer Park, race four, the four to one shot. Number three, Carfagin. Decent overall speed for this five and a half for a long sprint is hit the board in power run fashion in two of his last five adventures, including a power run win in his third race back. So from Parks Racing on a Sunday afternoon, Rick Needham for DayAtTheTrack.com reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.